Hello everyone, now I'm going to show you some effective techniques for a lifting effect. Our ear is surrounded by muscles and as we age they become weaker and our face along with ear moves forward like this. That's why we need to train these muscles. You can do this exercise every day. Step 1. So the thumb is placed behind the ear, the index finger in front of the ear and make circular motions up and back. Try not only to move the ear, but also your entire aponeurosis. Otherwise, this exercise will not make sense. You may even hear a slight crunch. So don't hurry, do it slowly and carefully. Don't damage the cartilage. Do this for at least 30 seconds. Step 2. At the back we have the occipital bumps here. Make deep circular motions. The movements are not superficial. We are working with the aponeurosis. Try to move the skin of the skull. And now completely go over the entire head. Move the skin, eliminate the sticking and adhesions. When the skin on the head is motionless, it provokes facial swelling, wrinkles and soft tissue ptosis. Always pay attention to the aponeurosis of the head. Step 3. Now put your thumb in your ears just inside and lift your ears up. Up and back a little bit. Hold it like this for 20-30 seconds. In this way, we also train the ear muscles. You can see how the lower part of the face is raised up.
Step 4. With each our masticatory muscles shorten and spasm. And this whole part goes forward. Like this. So let's work with this problem area. We take a large fold, pull it away from bone and gradually move towards the ear. You may feel pain in the area of the masticatory muscles. This means that they are under tension. Now do the other side. That's a great massage. I do hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to like this video so I know that my videos are useful for you. Take care and bye for now.